welcome to my channel so for today's video ipapasyal muna po namin kayo dito po sa Florence Italy ang mga larawan pong ito ay kuha sa hotel kung saan po kami natulog ng one night So, ito po yung room namin. Mag-tour muna po tayo. Ito po ang aking mag-ama at ready na po kami para lumabas at mag-tour dito po sa Florence. Hello mga kaibigan! Nandito na nga po tayo sa Ferenci de Duomo. Nagsasightseeing na po tayo ngayon. Ngayon po akong bago po kayo sa aking channel please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button para po lagi po kayong updated sa mga i-upload kong videos Chinichika ako ng panganay ko. Sabi niya sa akin, gusto daw niyang maging YouTuber. Nagpapabili siya ng magandang computer. At saka headphone. Natatawa ko eh. Magstay po sana kayo hanggang dulo para po makita ninyo ang breathtaking view na ipapakita po sa inyo dito po sa Florence. Enjoy! Siyempre, hindi makukumpleto kung wala po tayong family picture. Piazza del Duomo Cathedral Square is located in the heart of the historic center of Florence, Tuscany, Italy. It is one of the most visited places in Europe and the world and in Florence, the most visited area of the city. The square contains the Florence Cathedral with the Cupola del Brunelleschi, the Giotto's Campanile, the Florence Baptistery, the Loggia del Pigallo, the Opera del Duomo Museum and the Arcivescoville and Canonesis Palace. The west zone of this square is called Piazza San Giovanni.
another charge from Florence Cathedral of Santa Maria del Fiore. Open all of the time along the pedestrian zone south of Piazza della Repubblica towards Palazzo Pitti. Built very close to the Roman crossing, the Ponte Vecchio or Old Bridge was the only bridge across the Arno in Florence until 1218. The current bridge was rebuilt after a flood in 1345. During World War II, it was the only bridge across the Arno that the fleeing Germans did not destroy. Instead, they block access by demolishing the medieval buildings on each side. On November 4, 1966, the bridge miraculously withstood the tremendous weight of water and sealed when the Arno once again burst its banks.
And now we're going back to the hotel to rest. Another beautiful new day And now, nandito naman po kami sa isang restaurant na malapit po sa aming hotel. Kakain muna po kami ng aming favorite sushi bago po kami mag-tour ulit. Let's go to Palazzo Pitti!
the Grand Palazzo Pitti Florence proudly showcases to its curious visitors. If it weren't for the imposing size of the palace, its Sunday exterior would be rather unassuming, conveying very little of the opulence hiding inside. However, don't be misguided by the plain color of its facade. For centuries, Palazzo Pitti served as the principal residence of the Grand Dukes of Tuscany and stood to be inhabited, extended, and improved by the power Medici, powerful Medici, Lorraine, and Savoy families. To this day, the palace is probably the noblest and most majestic building in the city. Before you plunge into the lavish lives of the rich, dive in to find out all you should know before visiting this monumental residence. And let's go to the breathtaking view of Florence, Italy. Aside from Como, Italy and Paris, France, this is another romantic place for the lovers.
way back to hotel again.
So, kung naghahanap po kayo ng hotel, kung sakaling mag-stop po kayo sa Florence, maganda po ang Hotel Bologna na aming tinulugan. Two-star hotel po siya. Napakalinis po, napakakomportable, tahimik, at napakadami po ng almusal na inihain sa amin nakasama sa aming presentation. Let's go to our last stop, Pisa, Italy.
ngayon po ay nandito tayo sa Pisa, Italy. Look at my background. Let's go. We are here. The Leaning Tower of Pisa, or simply the Tower of Pisa, is the campanile or freestanding bell tower of the Cathedral of the Italian city of Pisa, known worldwide for its nearly 4 degree lean, the result of an unstable foundation. The tower is situated behind the Pisa Cathedral and is the third oldest structure in the city's cathedral square after the cathedral and the Pisa Baptistry. The height of the tower is 55.86 meters from the ground on the low side and 56.67 meters on the high side. The width of the walls at the base is 2.44 meters. Its weight is estimated at 4,500 met metric tons. The tower has 296 or 294 steps. The seventh floor has two fewer steps on the north facing staircase. The tower began to lean during construction in the 12th century due to soft ground which could not properly support the structure's weight and it worsened through the completion of construction in the 14th century. By 1990, the tilt had reached 5.5 degrees. The structure was stabilized by remedial work between 1993 and 2001 which reduced the tilt to 3.97 degrees. friends 
Thank you for watching. Sana po ay nasa maayos kayong kalagayan sa mga oras na ito. God bless po sa inyong lahat. If you like this video, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell button for more videos from me. Thank you! Yay!